What's going on guys, it's Lay. In today's video, I want to go over some fundamentals for editing. And I say that because I've watched a lot of videos on how to edit faster and whatnot. And I just feel like, yeah, those videos help you, you know, learn the basics of editing. And all these edit courses help you edit, and they do help. And it's a good warm-up, definitely. But I just want to go over some fundamentals that I believe will make your gameplay way better. And in a game, not just in practice. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Before we get started, if you're new to the channel, welcome as always. If you're looking for any tips, tricks, or guides to get better at Fortnite, you've come to the right place. Go ahead and hit the like and subscribe to get notified of any future updates. Now, let's get right into it. First things first, before you edit something, know what you're going to edit. If you're going to edit this right Dorito, you want to place your hit marker where your edit's going to start. If you want to start here, then start here and go that way. You want to start here, start here, and go that way. First things first is placing your hit marker ahead of your edit. That way, it's it's faster and more efficient. Second is when you're increasing your editing speed. It's not about your bind. I mean, it has a, your bind has a place in here. I mean, the easier you can reach your bind, you're going to edit quicker, or the more comfortable it is. But also, if you can hit, you can hit your bind button F, for example, on mine. I can hit F as fast as I can. But if I can't hit my edit, if I'm doing some some weird edit, it's not going to do anything. Focus on your accuracy. You want to really get your accuracy down. Even if you got to start slow, and just make sure you're hitting your edit. That's the number one thing you got to focus on is accuracy. After you've got your accuracy pretty much down, you want to speed it up a little bit. When I say speed it up, I mean just slinging your mouse or or your controller, whatever whatever it is on controller, just sling it. Just try and sling it as fast as you can. And that's how you focus on speed, is just slinging it. With edit with confirm now, all you gotta do is hit the edit. And then it'll do it once you let go. So don't hold your button. That's another thing that's very important, is a lot of people find themselves holding their, their bind. I used to do it. I'll take I'll take a part in that. I used to hold my edit button. Try not to hold your button. Just press it, edit. As soon as you get your edit, it should edit it. And now for the double edit bind, once you've got your speed, your accuracy, everything right, then you can focus on adding another edit bind. Because I feel like another edit bind doesn't really benefit you unless you're just so quick with it that you need another edit bind. And then you can really just speed up editing so much faster. But the last thing I want to really go over here is, yeah, all this stuff helps in practice, going and doing some courses or whatever. But it doesn't help if you can't build it and edit it in a real live game. So if you're fighting somebody and, and you can practice double edit binds all day in a, in a practice course, edit course, but if you can't hit it while you're building, then it doesn't matter how fast you can do it in the course. And that's what I used to find myself doing all the time is I'd do all these edit courses, but whenever it came down into a game situation, I couldn't edit. I could do it so fast on edit courses. So now what I try to do is, yeah, I'll go in an edit course and warm up, just warm my fingers up and, you know, get in a zone. But then I want to go, I want to go in a free, in my, in your map or whatever and just free build and practice those edits. Because if you can't do them while you're building, as you're building, shooting, fighting, then there's no point in being able to edit as fast as mongrel or somebody you know so just try to get in there and free build and practice your edit there and stop focusing on edit courses stop focusing on your keybind focus on your accuracy your speed and editing as you build well that's it for this video if you enjoyed or benefited from this video don't forget to like and subscribe for any future updates